Okay, this is going to be for Cancer. This is going to be the week of the 18th through the 25th. For those who do not catch the first video on what this little series is going to be, there is a previous video, okay? Um, I probably say this in all 12 of my zodiacs for this week. Energy, if I'm telling you this energy is going to be for um, January 18th through the 25th, I don't know if I said February, but if I said it's going to be through the 18th through the 25th of January, this is going to be your energy. I know a lot of readers will say energy is fluid, and that is facts. What manifests before, present, or after, okay, is the storyline. So I'm just giving you the energy. Let's leave it at that, okay? So... We're going to start with Cancer because that's what I cut first. So Cancer this is going to be January 18th through the 25th. Let's see what the 18th brings. 19th. And I do read reversals, guys. I'm just not right this second. Those won't reverse. Please. And that's twenty four. I actually wanted to do this differently, son of a bitch. Well, son of a bitch. Okay. Well, Cancer, you're going to be a little longer this week, apparently, because it must be the full moon in Cancer. Typically, what I wanted to do, how I kind of saw this going down with whatever card came out, grab the bottom card, was kind of like what I already saw for like this little mini series I'm going to do. But I spaced it. And you guys are the first ones. So. Hmm. I'm going to start over. For some of you, though, this might be completely two different storylines. For some of you today, it's like being torn. Torn on how to communicate, torn on how to say something. Um, it's, it's really communications the name of the game here. I don't know if you're worried someone's going to... walk away from you it's like I think you have energy that's angry right now too oh, see I really can't read it like this because this is not what I intended so that quick little message was for somebody. It keeps pulling me to the way I saw it, though, when I decided I was going to do this. Okay, so that's not going to work for me right now. So, we're starting over. And that's the way it is. Alright, let's do this again. This is going to be January 18th to the 25th. Okay, just... Quick little, quick peek at the energy. So the 18th, Cancer. I 
that again. I'll get used to it. I'll get used to it. That's exactly the same position that the other card was and was still talking communication. So, yeah. So technically I'm going to the 24th. Again, this is a message, just communication. This is either regarding a job, a position, commitment, a study, a hobby. I will tell you it's something you will probably be good at. If it's a, any type of new study or a new job, a new area of work, it's the Page of Pentacles. It's starting something new. It's tangible. It's something you'll see. It could be coming from a fire sign with the Knight of Wands here. It's a messenger, right? And... This is another message with an eight, eight of wands. So it's quick too. You want to get out, Max? Sorry, for those who are newbies on my channel, I'll stop the videos for the animals and the children. You'll get used to it. Um, again, this is another message, okay? <clears throat> so to me, this is kind of like the name of the game this week. For you guys is, is communication um, you're looking at justice tomorrow okay tell me tell me about justice real quick okay so making a fair and just decision looking like the balances as the scales are gonna be balanced regarding something and it, it's it's regarding the new moon or whatever was hidden or regarding feelings if there was hidden feelings this is you know it's the moon it rules the emotions um, and with the hermit, we got the lovers. So someone's been hush hush when it comes to making a decision regarding feelings. You know, something may come in. It looks like a decision's definitely being made by Friday. Saturday, it's kind of getting together, teamwork, putting things together, trying to figure some things out for sure. Um, you might be a little hesitant, especially if it's a new job position or anything to do with a commitment or a new area of study. You might be a little nervous or somebody else might be a little nervous regarding what's going on but a decision is is going to be in or being made or coming in by Monday of next week something will be aligned There will be a full completion of something in order for a new door to open. Okay. Um, some of you might even get this communication coming at you Sunday, Monday. But there is some type of communication going on back and forth between you and somebody regarding something that's about to start. Or again, you know, it's the Page of Pentacles. It's a new area of study. It's a job. It's something you're going to work towards. You're going to put effort into. You're going to work hard. Overall energy, please. Overall energy of cancer for the week of the 18th through the 24th. Letting go. So you are letting go in something in order to bring in abundance. Okay. Um, and we saw that and talked about it here. So as you're going into the 25th, it, it's, it's freshness. It's newness. Okay. So... That's positive. Let me give you one of these cards. For cancer, for cancer. So whatever it is that you're bringing into balance, letting go of, creating justice, balance, stability, um, it's, it's going to be a really good move. 
Yes. Near the dragonfly, you have magic. I embrace my transformation. I encourage you, encourage you, let, I encourage you, you guys, I encourage us, Lee, <laughs> let go of the past. The magic of nature is in me. I am brilliant and I am blessed. This is almost like self-doubt because to me, this is an affirmation, okay? So this is a big transformation. It is a big giant congratulations because this is letting one cycle close in order for another cycle to open. It, it's keeping the wheel moving. It's it's balanced. It's it's being aligned. You're sharp. You're intelligent. You know, especially with the Queen of Swords here, this is very sharp, intelligent. You take no bullshit. Um, I almost want to say, see no evil, speak no evil, hear no evil. It's the three monkeys. Um, hear no evil, see no evil, speak no evil. So I don't know what that's forgotten. But you, you don't mess with that energy, right? So it's, it's good. So whatever you're going into, you're being extremely smart about it. So... It's positive. So try not to doubt yourself. And if there's something you need to let go of, it, it's whether it's a past, a person, place, a thing, it's it's not a bad thing. It's a good thing because whatever this new cycle is, is clearly going to bring abundance. Okay. I think if you were to say no to something, it would be out of fear or doubt is what this is kind of showing showing me okay um so again i embrace my transformation they're basically saying have the courage to let go of the past the magic is in the nature the magic of nature is in me i am brilliant and i am blessed so this really does speak of of doubt okay so don't doubt this transformation others of you this is regarding love real briefly someone is going to make a pretty important decision someone that's been saying nothing and keeping something quiet about how they're going to proceed or what they want or if it's regarding their feelings you or this energy is going to make a feel um, a turnaround and, and that's going to change okay something is definitely aligning Please don't doubt yourself. Have a great week. Bye, guys.